It's a makeover with meaning. Five inmates at Junie's Correctional Centre have worked for months to restore this old panel van for a cystic fibrosis charity car rally next month. It had a big hit in the passenger side door uh, that, that didn't look nice and a lot of rust coming out. So uh, we, we got her down here, stripped her down and uh, got back to bare metal and repaired all the rust, replaced the door, replaced the tailgate. After a coat of paint, the car, nicknamed Rosie, is now ready to race. So why roses? A little boy couldn't pronounce his sister's condition, instead calling it 65 roses. Affecting the lungs and digestive system, for sufferers of CF, there is no cure. The rally is held annually to raise money and awareness of the genetic disease. There's a long way to, and a lot of money required to do the, the research, so we're willing to help out and, and get involved. Staff from the centre will also race in their own vehicle, named Incarceration. It's the fourth year the car has been entered. Going away with all the guys, there's 150 entrants, so going away with everybody and speaking to them and talking to the, the guys that suffer from CF, it, it, it really does hit home why we're doing it and why we're involved. Both cars will clock up around 5,000 kilometres over 10 days. The rally starts in Orange, travels across to the Flinders Ranges and ends in Marimbula. We're off on the 8th of October, uh, so not long to go now. Uh, the fundraising is ramped right up. We're heading for 20000 We're well on the way to that. We're up to about $13,000 now. A charity auction will be held at the Rules Club in Wagga tomorrow night. Sarah Burnell, Win News.